my shawty, my somebody, my bestie, my shawty. Hi guys, so I guess this is gonna be my little intro. Today I have traveled all the way from our rigger to come to this park that I found on Instagram. It's called uh, Mushrik Park. It's like, uh, let's just say 25 minutes, 30 minutes away from center point. Now I need to look at this place. Wait, what? How do you walk 30 minutes for 2.2 kilometers? That's what this thing, this thing is telling me. It is telling me it is this direction. Wait, what? Excuse me. Um, do you know where Mushrik Park is? Mushrik Park. That's right. Mushrik? Yeah. It's a screenshot. Oh, screenshot. Yeah. Yes. It's far. It's far. Yeah. Thank you. Welcome. I'm just gonna walk. I love you guys and stay tuned. My idea for this adventure is to like kind of give you guys some um, affordable attraction places where you guys can go with your loved ones, your family, all by yourself. This is budget friendly because from Auriga to Center Point, I tagged for like five dirhams. From Center Point to this place, which is called the Science Something Something, I forgot, but I'll just put the directions in the description uh, box. I tagged for like three dirhams. I guess it was closer and I tagged within the 30 minutes. I just hope I'll give you guys all these attraction places under a budget. Wow. It's telling me so far I've walked two minutes and I still have 28 minutes. But this is a 2.1 kilometer journey, so I don't know how this is supposed to be a 28 minutes walk. But it's fine. I'm a walk. I don't mind walking. I'm a walk. Oh, it's called the School of Research Science. It's over there. The bus stop is there. Down there where there is a post. But this is the name of the bus stop. This place doesn't look like a lot of people walk around here. Trust me, it doesn't. <laughs> it's safe to say it's a bit creepy if you are by yourself because, I mean, there's just cars. The only guy I met back there <laughs> I was trying to ask for directions. We boarded the same bus, so we came out at the same time. When I came out of the bus, that's when I'm like, wait a minute, where am I? Because <laughs> I don't see people. Like, guys, look around. Look around. Look around. Look around. No people in the street. Nobody. Just cars and me. Cars and me. Okay, I'm just praying there's a zebra crossing. Other than that, we are good to go. I thought I was getting lost, but I'm right on track. Look at where I'm going. There's the park and the arrow. Crocodile park. Wait, wait. What? I wasn't ready for the crocodile park. But okay, it's fine. Um, um, we good, right? We good. Crocodile park. Oh, it's actually next to it. Um, um. Oh my, I don't like crocodiles, but it's okay. I'm not going there. I'm going to this park, Mushrif Park. Shagana Kirako Kanamu Dubai is you are always surrounded by planes wherever you go. Wow, the place that I'm going, you guys, it's creepy and scary. Trust me. Let me show you guys ahead. There is nobody. Do you hear me? Like there is absolutely no one around here other than the workers i don't see any human oh my gosh how did i even convince myself to come to this place let me show you guys i'm surrounded by trees I'm surrounded by trees look at where I'm, where I'm going look at where i'm going guys there is construction going on Gosh, I am uh, okay. I need to call my man right now to let him know that I am. I don't know if I should call myself safe, but I don't feel safe right now. I don't. <sighs> Thank God, there's this action. Hello, um, sorry, is this the way to move something? Something. 
Is this the way to Sharif Park? Thank you. The road is a bit creepy. That is the way. I found a cyclist. And I'm sure he's actually shocked to see me on my own. And there's construction going on. I'm not sure if I'm supposed to use this road or the main road. Let me check because I don't want to go through those men in the construction site and let them think that I'm so weak. They can play with me. Okay, the main road, you can't really walk in it. See? You can't really walk. They don't have a pedestrian walk path. So I'm just going to use this. Pray for me. I'm sure if you're seeing this video, I must have gotten home safe. But for now, I'm not so sure. When someone says, why are you so scared? Guys, wouldn't be scared to walk in this path by yourself. I walked all the way down there, so all the way down there. And I'm not sure where I'm going, but there's a like, there's like a steep hill ahead of me. I don't know if you guys can tell, but there's a steep hill ahead of me. And that's why I'm kind of freaking out. Because so far I've only met with two construction workers down there and yeah this is just getting i don't know i didn't ask them where i'm going because i didn't want to look like i'm weak and i'm lost and i'm this i just smiled and you know said hi to them and make sure i don't show them that i'm alone so i'm weak and i'm lost i'm this and that nope i just greeted them and walked past them so the lady who found this park where i'm going i have so many questions for her because how did she discover this park to begin with and how did she travel here okay maybe she came by a car but even i feel like even if i was in a taxi or a car i was still gonna freak out because trust me the only thing you can hear is the beds the plane that just just passed i think this is like the third or fourth plane that passed by of course above me and that's the only sounds you can hear nobody is passing by not even a car how did she discover this park interesting i think this in a way oh now there's a car that just passed i think this in a way is like me going on an adventure this adventure was supposed to be me discovering affordable places attraction places for you guys that are affordable right but now i feel like this has turned into me facing my nightmares and my fears and see if i can conquer them the old me would have just turned back and go back home but we're not doing that we're not doing that around here oh my gosh i just realized i'm passing through some construction workers who are actually sleeping there 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 I think about five of them are sleeping. The chirping of birds is just super creepy. Can you just listen? Listen. All you can hear is birds, guys. Just birds. Not even a single human.
I tell you what's been on my mind? Sick and tired of the nine to five in the city light. Hey, darling, we could get out of town. See the beautiful world around, wanna see it now. Pack our bags and get in that car. Real far. Let's get out, we can leave this city Let's drive to the open air Yeah, the countryside is so pretty With the wind blowing in your hair We can look back someday Baby, don't you understand That we only get one life I wanna make it count Honey, come on now and take my hand The attention to go editor song and get ah so far the music is great, but let me just say something. I wanted to get inside this Japanese house, right? But manga mi neva nu varu mongo garare momo, so I couldn't get inside. I ended up going around like in circles, right? But trust me, this park was worth all the trauma and the torture that I went through, guys. And the cooking up and I, it was all worth it. Like, look at all those beautiful houses. I managed to turn my pictures around. Up and under those kangu go their house. You guys might be wondering why that with our voiceover, niche owner. But I'm like, you know what? I'm I'm a proud Zimbabwean. Like, when I started my channel, it's something that I I I said in my first few videos. Cause the quote, I'm a proud Zimbabwean. So why don't I just say it out loud in my videos? So yeah, guys. Iba ba ba tanga taba taya uska. Did you cut your jagaitik? Yes, lo moshe ne murko ne yandi serinda gaiyisa. Ore tindinda gaiyisa, but indirectly, here's what happened. I was busy filming with my camera, and then that was very kumba. That's when I realized that my camera settings were not set properly. And I mean, no, naga tinya bye. Panda ifa amban di komple na komple na muro di beze bye bye. Pane panda gato tinya. Then do vaya enda paslomo. And I didn't realize it until like I was home and I'm trying to edit. That's when I can see to my clips at pass long. But in a way, no kwanza kuisango music, chi chi chi, kungwe tonge kachirongo. But guys, trust me, this was a huge mistake that was made by me on my camera. pictures. The beauty of just walking around with your tripod and just get your own pictures. Oh my gosh, you guys don't understand it. I was enjoying myself and just to go and before I move on to another house. This one is what? We have this one. No be in house. No be in house. Let me show you my house. There's another one over there, another one over there, another one over here. So yeah, let's check them out. The one that I'm excited to watch is that one. Can you see it? The black and white. This one, but I'll go the last. Let me check this one that's close to me. Can someone tell this kid I'm not looking for one, please? Please, no. I don't like cats at all. Like, please, I'm not a cat person. You should feel the energy. I, I don't like you. You're not welcome here. Cat lovers, please rescue me. I don't like cats. They cry a lot. Like, it's so creepy. They cry a lot. A peacock over there oh my god i wasn't i was prepared for the adventure but not to face all my fears there are lots of animals around here lots that's a peacock that's a peacock over there 
How am I supposed to go there? How? How? And why is it screaming at me? Why is it screaming at me? Is that a peacock or it's a turkey? Guys, what's that? Is that a peacock or it's a turkey? Please, I'm not going there. I'll just show you guys around. Really, I want to go to this house. Can you see it? I want to go to this one. Oh, I see a human being. There's a human over there. There's a human by this tiny car. But I want to go to this house and I can't because there is a peacock on the neighboring house and I'm scared it might attack me. The cat has been following me over there. And there's a peacock that I know it's hiding behind that thingy. What should I do? I want to get in there. I want to check out this house. I'm still going to do it. <gasps> the peacock is coming. I'm not going there. I'm not going there. Can you see? 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 There's a peacock. I'm not going there. I am not going there. Let me run away with my life. I'm gonna run away with my life. Let's explore this house. But look at how many cats are around here. Let me show you guys. See, there is a cat. There is a cat. There is cats around. Like, I don't know. This one is a boomer house. If you guys can't see, I need to go check it out. I'm going to leave you guys like this. I'll be right back. The stories I've been told They never seem to leave my mind Ooh, And this road that I am on i got to stay here for some time Let me just show you guys other houses. There is this one which is an Indonesia house. There is also a Thai house and then there's that one i'm not sure what that is i can't really read netherlands house i can't go there because i'm surrounded by stray cats time has gone and i grew up i somehow made it through without losing sight mm -hmm. and i still wonder where you are and if you found a way out from Stories I've been told They never seem to leave my mind mm, On this road that I am on They are saying no pets allowed or they meant dog Because cat is a pet and there's so many cats in this huh. So many cats There is a villa shop at the kids area But it's closed I think due to Ramadan but it's so cool. I just like the vintage style that it has. So much space for kids area. All the way down there and down there. There's like some swings down there as well. For the kids. The play area is really big guys. It is all the way down there. Wow. And there is Baskin Robbins, but of course, due to Ramadan, it is not open. I don't think I want to keep exploring this this park because it's really humongous. It's big than I expected. But trust me, all the torture that I went through was worth it. I survived the creepy thing. Though I didn't really interact with cats, I was trying to avoid them as much as I could. I'll take this as a win why simply because i don't like cats around me and for me to be dealing with cats all over everywhere in every like every house that i went there were cats to me it's a win a win is a win <laughs> and yeah i tried to avoid peacock as much as i could and there were techies as well and i saw some roasters and some chickens and they have a bun as well they have a bun so I'm sure they also have like horses down there. Let me show you. Down, around. Do you see the brown thing? This brown thing. That's a bun there. And so I'm trying to avoid that area as much as I can as well. Oh, did I visit this place? Oh, maybe I did. No, I did not. There is another place that I need to visit. Another house. Let's visit it. And maybe explore a little bit more before we go because oh my gosh 
talk about the devil talk about the devil no i don't like cat i mean it's like i need to slap one cat and that cat can walk around and tell the others that i'm scared of them i'm terrified of them i don't socialize with cats but anyway guys i'm at the chinese house let me show you to take you guys inside but i encountered a cat there to show you the interior but nevertheless let's look around this nature if you're someone that loves the nature and if you're very introverted or you are someone who wants to escape the loud and the noisy city life I think this will be a good start this will be a very good place for you but just to give you a heads up it's not gonna be <laughs> an adventure if you're coming i mean it's gonna be an adventure to remember if you're coming on public transportation but if you are coming on like a taxi or your personal car or a borrowed car whatever it might be then i think the adventure will begin in here lucky for you unfortunately for some of us we learned the hard way and i actually feel like i enjoyed it the freaking out part as much as i think about it i feel like i kind of enjoyed it because that's that was like basically me facing my fears because i'm terrified of a lot of things so i'm seeing those mushroom rooms i don't know their houses their rooms let's go check them out then we head out guys and the jungle buddha mama mushroom me mom and the not to zumbo and the and the and yes i use public transport on my way back home it wasn't an easy journey because i didn't find like my bus i found another bus and i got to the station and it took another one up until i went to the last station where i was in this bathroom bye guys thank you for watching Thank mm -hmm. you.